My name is Nancy Lin and I focus on breast cancer. Every day I use the latest advances in science um, and I integrate that with taking care of a whole person um, because taking care of somebody living with cancer is not only taking care of their tumor, it's really taking care of their mental health and their physical health and their emotional health and putting it all together is incredibly rewarding. I think the thing I would want patients and their family members to mo know most of all is that I am here for them and uh, the team that takes care of, of the patient will be there for them and, and we're really here, our, our mission and our purpose is to take good care of people who are living with a diagnosis of breast cancer. Dana-Farber has been on the forefront um, both in patients with early stage as well as metastatic disease. So in patients with early stage disease, um, investigators within the breast program have developed a less toxic yet very effective regimen that cures the majority of patients with uh, early stage HER2 positive breast cancer, so it's been really exciting to be part of that. Uh, and nowadays, with um, scalp cooling technology, uh, many patients don't even need to lose their hair uh, while they receive curative intent therapy for their early stage disease. In terms of uh, radiation, there are new techniques to try to reduce the side effects of radiation. And again, uh, the radiation oncologists here are not general radiation oncologists, they're brain-focused radiation oncologists, uh, and that's all they do. And so we really have cutting edge technologies to target radiation to specific locations, as well as technologies to spare critical structures so that they um, are less affected by the side effects of radiation. What gives me hope is, is, is really the knowledge of how much things have changed over the last 20 years. And I've seen from the beginning of my medical training until today, just tremendous advances in how we care for breast cancer patients and improvements in how people do. And I truly believe that someday we will be able to cure people who have metastatic breast cancer. And I think that that will happen in my lifetime.